Hammer Bowling. Nothing hits like a hammer. Welcome to Hammer Bowling's final taboo introduction, the Taboo Jet Black. I'm Jeff Ussery, the Hammer Brand Manager. Taboo Jet Black incorporates our strong inner core shape from the Black Widow series balls. By using a heavily textured cover stock with a polished finish, we've moved the ball performance further down the lane with a sharper back end reaction. The Jet Black Taboo offers serious down lane motion for the Hammer brand and a significantly different shape than the rest of our polished balls in the lineup. Let's get right to the lane with our Hammer test team throwing the Taboo Jet Black against the Taboo Blue Silver from last fall. We chose Kegel's Easy Street pattern for this polished finish Taboo. We'll start with Robert Flunder IV. He'll first throw the Blue Silver from last fall and then follow it with the Jet Black Taboo. You can see immediately that Blue Silver was an earlier and smoother product on the lane whereas Jet Black is further down the lane with quicker response to the friction. The Jet Black Taboo gives Robert a lot of confidence when throwing the ball as it'll peel back from anywhere on this easy street pattern. You can see in the FCC hook ratings that Jet Black Taboo is less overall hook than the Blue Silver, but further down lane as shown by the tracers from Robert's shots. Big baller Jeremy Hunt's up next, throwing the Taboo Jet Black. Jeremy's able to push the Jet Black much further down the lane, delaying the break point until just before the pins. By delaying the break point, Jeremy's able to really mix the pins up with the Taboo Jet Black. On the overhead view, you see the difference in Jeremy's two ball reactions, almost four total boards at the arrows. Next up is Kim Mann with her straighter style, and you'll really see the power of Taboo Jet Black with her game on this easy street pattern. You can see that the Taboo Blue Silver was a more rounded and arky shape, whereas the Jet Black Taboo gives more definition at the breakpoint and more power down lane. Kim's Jet Black Taboo drives through the 8-pin at the straighter angles on this easy street pattern. You can see just how different these two balls are even for a straighter, lower rev style like Kim Mann. Next up is Sean Lee, our medium rev staffer. You can see the rounded continuation from the Taboo Jet Black with Sean's style on this Kegel Easy Street pattern. Finally, we have Les Mann, our left-hander from Wooster, Ohio. The Blue Silver Taboo is one of Les's favorite reactions with a mid-lane move and strong continuation. But as you've seen from the other players, Jet Black Taboo offers a cleaner front-end motion with more response down lane in front of the pin deck.
Les is able to play straighter through the front, but get more entry angle into the pin deck with the Taboo Jet Black. Hammer's new Grand Theft Reactive 3 solid cover stock features an aggressive move down lane with the sharpest back end motion in the history of Hammer Bowling. Check Hammer out on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and on HammerBowling.com.